So as many of you guys know, I have never ever really been a Bray Wyatt fan, especially not The Fiend. I have hated The Fiend with a passion. But after last night, after that crazy production, after how loud those fans were and how much attention Bray Wyatt's return got, yo, even I gotta admit, Bray Wyatt is that guy. So Bray Wyatt returned last night after Extreme Rules in a production which was probably the budget of a small indie horror film and they showed all these old characters that he was associated with, everyone was singing a song and they even showed the Firefly Funhouse destroyed and then like some shit out of a horror movie, Bray Wyatt pulled up and the crowd went absolutely mental. This crowd was tweaking like their long lost father had just finally come back from the gas station. And the best part in my opinion was we got Bray Wyatt back, he took the mask off, there was no fiend he wasn't the fiend the lamp was back bray was back and the crowd was losing it and i can't lie it was a pretty cool scene and the reception online has been crazy the views on youtube make no sense 1.1 million views in 11 hours twitter was going crazy there were even parents posting videos of their kids losing their minds on twitter of bray wyatt returning and like yo Respect to Bray Wyatt. To me, Bray Wyatt was his best in 2014 and 2015 when he was cult leader Bray, you know, basically Charles Manson. In my opinion, that was his peak. I wouldn't say I was ever a Bray Wyatt fan, but I truly appreciated him when he was doing his run in 14 and 15. The Fiend character, on the other hand, okay, listen, I know some people love it, okay? They worship the Fiend. Some people's entire personalities for some reason centers around the Fiend. To me, though, nah, like, I, I just never got it with the Fiend. To me, it just never clicked. I was never intrigued. The promos were whatever the matches sucked in my opinion i hated the red light it got to a point where it's like oh shit the fiend's in a match damn do i really have to watch this i hate using this word because now every wrestling fan online calls everything cringe but to me the fiend was actually cringe but that's not how it used to be for bray wyatt yo once upon a time bray wyatt used to pull up in the wyatts against the shield or when he went crazy with daniel bryan at the rumble or even when he was teaming up with randy orton that to me was bray wyatt at his best when he had a character he still cut the promos he still did all his weird shit but you also knew that when he went into the ring shit was gonna pop off and last night even though we saw the fiend in the crowd Bray Wyatt wasn't the fiend, Bray was Bray, and right now Bray Wyatt he's back, he is on fire, the wrestling world is watching, the wrestling world is behind him, he took a break, he's refreshed, he's back. And there is just so much potential here. If Bray Wyatt is back to putting in work in the ring and having a character that is intriguing that doesn't limit him in the ring, this could be something very special. Bray Wyatt is a very creative guy, a little too creative sometimes, but I think now with Triple H in the cut and them seeing how The Fiend went down, how everything went with that, they should know how to handle Bray going forward. They should know how to make Bray top tier again because they had it once upon a time. They can definitely do it again. And yo, what better way to start than having this epic return that sent everyone into a frenzy? Like I said, I have never been a Bray Wyatt fan, but I always respected him, especially when he had the Hawaiian shirt. I don't like The Fiend, never did, never will, but but that's just me. If you like The Fiend, amazing, respect to you. But this return from the QR codes, the videos, the rabbits, the return itself, it had people talking, it had people going crazy, and at the end of the day, no matter what my opinion is or anyone's, wrestling is at its best when people react like how they were last night. So for that, I'm happy. At the end of the day, if you're a Bray Wyatt fan and you've been waiting over a year for this, I am happy for you because wrestling is better when everyone's happy. Over the past year, I've always seen people like, oh, I wish Bray would come back, I wish The Fiend would come back, and I'm just there like, okay, yeah, if he you know if he comes back cool if he doesn't it's fine but after last night seeing the buzz that bray got seeing the way people tweaked for him it really did prove that bray wyatt is that guy so i can't hate on that it was a crazy return there was so much potential from here and this could end up being special bray wyatt is back the ending of the pay-per-view was crazy fans are loving it and honestly who am i to hate then i really hope this continues to be elite and please for the love of god just give me some more throwback 2014 bray wyatt type beat matches i want to see bray wyatt pull up to pay-per-views and just casually catch mother canuckers in the air with a sister abigail i need bray wyatt to go back to what made him so elite in the first place and if he does, this could be awesome. I'm hoping for the best. But anyway, in the comments down below, let me know what you guys thought of the return. Let me know what you guys want to see the WWE do with Bray Wyatt going forward. How should they handle this? What do you want to see? It's your boy Pav, aka Wrestling. I've just wanted to make a quick video after the show last night. Just talk about what everyone's been talking about. More content coming soon. And remember, leave your comments down below. I always read them. I'm out of here, okay? Take it easy, guys. Later.